Hello, hello. We got a special guest. We're just gonna let a couple of minutes go by to see if anybody jumps on. Got my hair and my makeup did today for once. Do I look beauteous? I feel beauteous because I barely wear makeup anymore. But I have an awesome night ahead of me sharing uh, tonight with some awesome like-minded individuals in the vegan community. I, have, I think it's like a hair, like a, a brush hair, like a makeup brush hair stuck in my lip gloss. It's gonna bother me, but whatever. But hello, hello, welcome back. Um, I've been gone for a while, I apologize for that. But um, happy Wednesday, happy hump day. Hey Faith, this is Faith Grace. Say hi to Faith. Yes. No, that's mom's lip gloss. Nope, that's mine. Thank you. She likes to eat my lip gloss. All oh, kisses. Thank you. We're going to put her down and let her out. So, happy hump day. Welcome back. Welcome back. Today is the first Wednesday of the month. And what we normally do on the first Wednesday of the month is what? Let's talk oils. We are going to talk about the most popular oils. And... You know what? Give me two seconds because, hi Oscar. Give me two seconds because I have this hair. I feel like it's gonna bother me. Yep, there it is. That would have bothered me the whole time. Sorry, beauty problems. I haven't worn makeup in a long time. And I'm sitting here like putting stuff all on my face. Anyway, so how is it going? Um, I love, to be back and share this space with you guys. This is a little tall, there we go, perfect. Why is this bouncing around? Let's cancel that. All right, and we're back. No more distractions. Anyway, so I love sharing this space with you guys to teach you guys my passion of essential oil usage and natural alternatives. Um, we're gonna go ahead, you can go ahead and, and like, comment, and share. I'm sure that there's somebody out there that would be interested um, in essential oils or natural alternatives or just to know that you have an option. So go ahead and um, you can tag them here. Hi Tiff! You can go ahead and tag them here or um, send this live to them, however you do that. I'm sure that there's an option somewhere. But um, just let me know and um, let them know. If you are catching the replay, let me know. Uh, if you're not able to get up here on live, you can also, or catch me live, you can also um, it's always on my feed on my Facebook, but you can also go to my YouTube. You can just search my name, Lindsay I. Marino, subscribe, and you will always get notified if there's something, uh, anything added, promos, classes, DIYs, anything new in doTERRA land or Lindsay land. Um, I have posted my November class schedule, so you can, if you haven't checked that out, go ahead. It's on my Facebook and my Instagram. Show it some love and some likes. Um, you can share that with anybody too or tag people that you think that might be interested in the classes or any of the DIYs or the awesome stuff coming up for November. So you can calendar your dates. That's why I like doing the monthly. I'm going to be trying to do every single Wednesday, Wednesday at 7 p.m. Um, tonight didn't work because I'm going to be out and about and um, a couple others didn't work. So either 3 p.m. or 7 p.m. Um, every Wednesday. So that's what it's going to be. Um, I feel like that would be an awesome simplified way to share with you guys. So, you can um, go to my YouTube if you don't, um, hi Ash, if you can't catch me live, you can catch me on my YouTube, I already said that. So, let's get started. My name is Lindsay I. Marino. I'm an essential oil educator and team leader for doTERRA International, and I'm also an Aroma Touch certified practitioner and a lover of essential oils and all things wellness. Um, so if you are in the area and Palm Beaches, Broward or Dade, you can um, hit me up and if you have been on the fence about oils and you want an awesome hands-on experience with essential oils, I will throw my massage table in the back of my car and I will bring the oils to you. So you just let me know. Reach out to me. Go ahead. Right there. Just right there. Anyway, so um, in this class, you are going to learn how to take care of 80% of your health and wellness needs. So if you're new to oils, beginning with oils, never heard of oils, 
heard of them but never knew how to use them holistically or medicinal or anything like that, this is a great class for you or a great class for you to tag someone who may be interested in it who is new to oils. So um, you're also going to learn what an essential oil is, um, how to use them, why we use them, and a little bit about doTERRA. So let's get to talking about what an essential oil actually is. It is a pure extract that is uh, a pure a liquid extract of a plant. So it's either from the plant, uh, the root, the stem, the leaf, the flower, the bud, the bark, um, or citrus, um, any type of citrus, because we have a lot of citrus oils. And that is either cold pressed or steam distilled. And they have therapeutic properties that can support many of your uh, wellness concerns. So they are 100% plant, plant derived and with no additional pro uh, processing um, or preservatives or fillers or other ingredients. So um, the difference, quality is everything. The difference between the oils that you probably see on the store shelves um, in you know um, health food stores and all of that is you know quality is everything you not all oils are created equal you want to do your research before buying them from those stores so um, I'm here to educate you and every every company is jumping on the essential oil bandwagon and they can take one drop of pure essential oil and put it in a bottle and fill it with artificial fragrance fillers dilutions and slap a hundred percent pure essential oil and even call it therapeutic when it's really not you always want to read your labels because oils like that will say do not ingest, may irritate skin, flammable. Like you're like, what? <laughs> um, I actually went into a store today and I wanted to post about it, but I just took the pictures and I'll post later um, about these oils that were like, I don't know, $9.99 for three of them and it said flammable, this and that. And I was like, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Um, so we're going to talk about that to make sure you're not going to get the wrong ones if you're giving the gift of health and wellness. Um, so quality is everything. Um, a few reasons why we should love essential oils. They are a natural alternative to or and remedy to um, chemical filled products in your household. Um, it's an easy solution that you can ask, access right in your ha household to keep being healthy. And they are pennies per drop with fast results. When I say fast results, I mean you can take a drop of our digestive uh, blend which is digest zen and put it on your tummy if you're having tummy problems and in within seconds minutes gone i mean just gone um it really blew my mind when i needed it the most when i was going um into my plant-based diet so um just always do your research you want to be able to um choose oils from a trusted company and uh, essential oils are not regulated. So companies can place a drop in there and then fill it with whatever they, whatever they want. And it sucks, but it is what it is. And I went to the store today, which I really don't go shopping much, but I needed a few things. And, um, well, go shopping much outside of my house. Let's just rephrase that real quick. I shop, but just not outside of my house because people love people, but they're not the hot, most hygienic people in the entire world, let's just say. But it was nice to go to a couple of stores for some bath stuff that I needed for my bathroom um, and some decorations and decor and stuff since we're redoing our bathroom and it's almost done. 99%, another 1% and we'll be completely finished and I'll be able to get up in there and be using, oh yes, we will not be in the office when we do the lives because the lighting is not the best in here. I have a lamp here. I have, it's crazy. But um, I will have my own vanity in my bathroom. It's a beautiful um, lighted mirror vanity where I can do my hair or my makeup or my oil classes. Yes. So it's a beautiful, beautiful space to be able to um, talk to you guys and awesome stuff. So I'm excited about that because there's better lighting in there. So. Anyway, got off topic. So anyway, choose from a trusted company like doTERRA when buying your essential oils because we're different. We have certified pure therapeutic grade oils. They're super ultra concentrated, so a little goes a long way. Just a drop or two will, uh, usually is, is enough for top, topical or dietary use. Um, it takes 45 lemon rinds to fill a bottle of lemon. It takes one drop of peppermint oil to, equi to um, is equivalent to 28 cups of peppermint tea. 
crazy. It's crazy. I love a good pep peppermint. So that's a good segue to show you how to use it. So I'm going to use the peppermint. There's three ways that you can use your essential oils, okay? Aromatically, topically, and internally. So aromatically, you can use it in a diffuser like the petal right there. Oh, Instagram, you can't see the petal. Hold on, let me get it. Whoopsies. Facebook, Facebook, you can see it. Here she is, all in her glory. If I can get it. I need that thing what Ellen does. I need my own little sound effects. Um, so this is the doTERRA petal. It is a great starter diffuser. It goes for about four hours. Four or four hours. It has a different time settings. You could do one hour, two hour, four hours. And it has a little night light on there too so it can go next to your kid's bed. They can turn it off and on. You have different options. And you can blend up whatever you want in there. I'm going to talk about these later, but I got some holiday joy up in there because it's South Florida and it doesn't feel like fall. It doesn't feel like the holidays. So my um, amazing blends are all the rave in my house and um, that's what helps me make it feel like fall. And my decorations will um, be coming down out of the attic very shortly so that will that will be happening i just messed my hair up trying to fluff it up a little bit okay anyway so aromatically you can use it in a diffuser or you can um do a palm inhalation if you um don't uh, have a diffuser or um and you have your oils with you so what you do is you just take your palm you do one drop of whatever type of oil and when you're doing this um it can calm emotional upsets it can boost energy support your airways, purify the air, and promotes restful sleep, depending on what essential oil you're using. And we're gonna go over um, a bunch of them. But this is peppermint. I like to call it my peppermint pick-me-up. If you're watching, you can do this with me. I'm gonna just rub it together, heat it up, and do three palm inhalations. I love peppermint. And you just do three deep inhalations. I'm just gonna enjoy this for a second. And then you have a little bit um, left over, like a little bit of oil residue left over on your hands. Um, and you just wipe it on the back of your neck, on your front of your neck, wherever. Voila! And then you get that effect when you're doing a palm inhale, it goes right into um, your sensors here and it goes right into your brain, into your limbic system and just uh, whatever the oil is supporting. So peppermint supports um, fatigue and tiredness and all of that. So you can definitely um, get a good pickup from that if you're having like a midday slump. Um, second way is you can use your oils topically and topically we can use them Let's just grab one of these. Okay, topically we use them in a roller bottle. So you can make all these fun blends in a roller bottle. Whoop. Rolling over cords here. Got so much stuff everywhere. Hi Sierra. So you can um, use them topically by using a, a roller bottle and some fractionated coconut oil. Um, shout out to Becky from the Root and Petal. We love her roller bottles. These are the best roller bottles ever. They are at rootpedal.com or on Amazon as well. Um, $12.99, I think, for a 10-pack. Amazing. Super, super amazing quality. Fun color-coded. And the, um, the ball is a frosted glass ball. It's not plastic. It's not stainless steel. Stainless steel is okay. Plastic is a no-go. Um, but I prefer a good... Um, frosted glass ball and then you can just put on your pulse points and you can rub it in topically back of your neck for whatever you're trying to support at that moment um, so you can soothe tired muscles with using oils topically you can ease discomfort you can calm skin irritation and support your immune system I mean it's never ending with topical use so internally this is a good one so internally I like to take my glass or stainless steel bottle you never want to use plastic because over time it can break down the plastic and we don't want that so i use lemon i like to use lemon internally every single day so i will fill up my bottle and i'll put a few drops two three four. i like to put more this is 32 ounces so i put um maybe three to four 
If you're using something smaller, one to two, you really don't need that much. But that's how much I'll put in for the whole day because when the water goes down, the oil residue will hold on to the side of the bottle. And once you just fill it up with water again, you don't need to add more oil. So you just give it a little zhuzh. Voila. Yummy, yummy lemon water. And we're gonna go over the benefits of that lemon water. So you can also um, take your um, essential oils in a veggie capsule. So if you're new to essential oils and you're new to taking them internally or you're going to be new to taking them internally, we will go over our protocol on how to do that. But you can make any little concoction in your veggie cap. It's really super easy. You'll have a bigger end and a smaller end. Here's the bigger end and a smaller end. And you just place a few drops in there to support whatever it is that you're needing to support. And voila, done, easy peasy, right? Um, another way is you can cook with your essential oils, you can bake with them, you can also um, take them internally by way of taking our supplements and our, excuse me, our vitamins. Um, they are, we are an essential oil company, but they are our number one product. Um, we, they are infused with essential oils. And the difference between internal and not internal oils, because we have, most of them are internal, but um, some of them are not. So the difference is the supplemental facts label. So if you can see that, I don't, you can't see it too clearly, but this is a supplemental facts label, which is a food grade label. Facebook, you can see that more clearly. Um, that means you can take the oil internally. If it does not have one, like this one does not have a supplemental facts label, if it does not have one, that just means that it's for topical and aromatic use only. Um, so you can put it in your diffuser, Aromatically, you can also put it on diffuser jewelry. So this is a mala, and it has lava rock beads. So if you've ever seen lava rock bracelets or earrings or necklaces or anything like that, you can put your oil, let's put a little bit of this roller on here. You could take straight oil and put it on too, but I like to use a little roller, and you just roll right on. And this will actually help, it smells so good, will just um, help you be able to aromatically smell the oil, as well as putting it on yourself too. But if you just wanted it to last longer, um, you could put, I have a couple of bracelets, I have this mala, and I saw uh, really cute ones that are in the ears, the little lava lava in the ears, because that's really close to your nose. So that would be a really cool one to, um, to get. So, safety tips. You don't want them in your ears, in your eyes, or in your nose. Um, if that does happen, you want to go to your fractionated coconut oil. You do not want to go to water because oil and water doesn't mix. It'll just intensify it. So you want to, um, if you get it in your eyes, you can just go to your essential, go to your fractionated coconut oil. Um, you also, with our, all of our citrus oils, they are photosensitive. So if you're applying them, you want to go ahead and um, wait at least 12 hours until after applying the citrus oils before you go directly under, um, on into the sunlight. So that's a big one. And also I have a dilution chart that I like to go by for making little roller bottles for adults or your kiddos. Um, there is a chart that I can go over with you when you're ready to get started. So um, I can go all over with all of that with you. So let's get to talking about the top 10 oils. So first up is our uh, frankincense. And I love frankincense. It is an internal oil. It has the supplemental fax label. There's our frankincense. It has the supplemental fax label, so that means you can take it internally for medicinal uses. And this is one of my favorite essential oils that I use for my morning proactive essential oil usage pro protocol. If I could get that out. Try it again. Um, it is the Cadillac of oils, in my opinion. And, it, and it's an, an, an enhancer oil for blends. So if you're making a blend, it kind of just um, boosts the other essential oils. So I always put a drop or two in any of my blends, to be honest. Um, it is great for anxious feelings. It is amazing for anxious feelings. I've been a high anxiety person all of my life. And um, uh, this has really um, calmed my nervous system and my emotions down and been, been, have been able to be uh, and maintain my emotions, which is amazing. And this is so pure, I'm going to show you. Now don't say, Lindsay told me to put oils underneath my tongue. No, I didn't. I'm going to show you. That is how I take my frankincense in the morning, every single morning. And I hold it under there for 30 seconds, but I don't need to right now because I need to talk. 
And that helps me with my anxious feelings, cellular support, inflammation throughout my body. Because I was in a bad car accident in 2005. So I have a lot of um, disc herniations and um, disc bulges and soft tissue damage that I have aches and pains. So I, move, I work out every single morning for an hour at Pure Bar and I use this to help with inflammation. So I am off all of my medications, all prescription medications gone off of it. Hi Patty! Um, I have been off of them for three and a half years. It took me two and a half months after it being introduced to essential oils to getting off of all of those medications and I can happily say that I have never felt better in or looked better, no offense, but I'm feeling very, very great. I'm down 15 pounds and I just am feeling better than I did in my 20s, to be honest. Um, so when in doubt, frank it out. That's what I like to say. Um, you can apply it topically, you can take it internally, you can um, diffuse it. It's amazing all three ways. So next we're gonna go is to peppermint. Peppermint, I showed you how to do the peppermint pick-me-up. It is also, hi David. It is also um, a supplement, has internal oil. It has a supplemental fax label. And peppermint is really good for cooling, especially when it's hot down here in summer, um, in, um, hi guys, um, in uh, the summertime. Hi Kenny, hi Brandon, hi Patty, hi Patrick. Megan, hey Megs, everybody's jumping on. So good to see all of you guys. Um, if you see me looking both ways, I am double broadcasting on Facebook and on Instagram. And we are going over peppermint essential oil right now. So it's very cooling for South Florida all year round because it's warm down here. Um, it has a cooling effect. So um, especially for summertime anywhere, you can um, place it in a roller bottle like this and swipe up and down um, the spine of a child or an adult and it will bring down body temperature naturally. Um, it also promotes a healthy respiratory system. It also helps to reduce head and neck tension. Um, you could put a place it on your temples, top of your forehead, in the back of the neck, or down your shoulders. That's where I normally hold my um, tension. And um, it also supports your digestive system. So you can take it internally or apply it to your stomach to help with an upset stomach. It's very energizing and invigorating for alertness and focus. And inhaled, you can help fight some fatigue or that midday slump. Um, I showed you how to do the palm inhale before. If you are late, you can uh, replay this, watch the replay, and, and learn how to do that. So the next oil is Melaleuca, which is our tea tree oil. And this oil is also, uh, has the supplemental facts label on it, so it is safe for internal use. I take this oil every single day, and I'll tell you why. And I use it every single day topically and internally. It is amazing. It is antifungal, anti-everything, anti-stink. And I use it as my acne little spot treatment. And um, it's amazing. It just kind of like sucks it up and dries it up and like poof, be gone. Naturally. No dermatologist recommended stuff and everything like that. Um, I will not go back to a dermatologist because they basically um, did me wrong. They did me wrong and I'll never go back there. But um, being educated and having the knowledge that I do to share with you guys, I can also teach you how to live a more healthy and natural lifestyle as well. So um, it's cleansing and rejuvenating to the skin. I call it my zit zapper, like I was saying before. It's really just good for disinfecting and it supports the immune system um, when taken internally. So, or, um, hi Jordan. Tay Tay, hi girl. Um, it said Jordan at first, I'm like, Jordan? I'm like, no, that's Taylor. Hey girl. Um, so, Lemon is next. Lemon, we talked about putting it in the, our water. It's also good, safe for internal use. It has the supplemental facts label. And it's naturally detoxifying and supports the digestion when taken in your water, like I showed you before. And how many ounces are you supposed to be drinking daily? Half your body weight in ounces daily in water. We are made up of water. So we need that to be able to detox and uh, clean out our systems. So, half of my body weight is two of these. These are 32 ounces, and so it's about, like I would say, 60. Um, 60 ounces of water is all I need, but I drink a lot more than, than that. So it's really good to flush and cleanse and flush and cleanse. Um, so, speaking of cleanse, lemon is very um, cleansing and purifies the air when it's diffused. 
good for stinky shoes. You could put it on a little cotton ball. You could put some in a, uh, in some honey for an irritated throat. Um, it gets good, takes off sticky residue for a little life hack. Or um, if your kids think that they are um, artists and they're drawing on your furniture and on your uh, walls, lemon will take it right out. Gum in the hair, gum on skin, uh, Sharpie. I mean, lemon is amazing. Um, so that is a staple in, in, in our house, not because I have little ones running around, but because I have dogs that like to step in stuff and bring sticky stuff all over my floors, or if I'm getting like a little mug or something from TJ Maxx or Ross or something and you wanna take the sticker off, you just put a couple drops of lemon, you let it sit and it peels right off. No muss, no fuss, it's amazing. All right, on to the next. Lavender, lavender is also an internal oil. It is safe for internal use. And it is all things calming. It's one of my favorite. Lavender got me off of my sleep aid two and a half years ago, or three and a half years ago. It took me two and a half months to get off of my, um, we'll call it Ambien. Let's just say how it is. I was loving my Ambien for three years. I am a light sleeper. My mom introduced me to it. I was like, mom, I'm not sleeping. She's like, here, take this. It is horrible for you after I started getting educated. It is so bad for you. I'm actually trying to get her off of it now. Um, it is a chemically made, man-made pill, and it has antidepressants in, after, uh, antidepressants in it after I did my research. So I'm so happy that I got off of that. Um, I would sleepwalk or sleep eat and just like do a whole bunch of like crazy stuff that I didn't remember, and it's just not good for you because it puts you in like psychosis. That can't be safe or normal or natural. And up in here, we are all natural. So, um, it is great for anxious feelings. It's all things calming. Lavender. It's good for skin support. If you burn, scratch, or have a cut or anything, maybe you um, in in the kitchen, you can cleanse first with the melaleuca and tea tree to clean the area, and then you can layer it with the lavender. It helps um, support the skin, and you can also uh, help the skin recover quickly. And when I say quickly, I mean like within like 24 hours, it's starting to scab over and no scarring, no nothing. I mean, lavender is absolutely amazing. Um, it promotes restful sleep, like I was saying. It got me off of my um, sleep aids. And I love lavender. I could put a drop in my chamomile tea at night or a sleepy time tea, diffuse it right next to your bedside in the diffuser over here that I showed earlier, Instagram I showed earlier, you can get the replay. Um, and um, it also eases muscle tension. So, or any type of tension, really. Muscle tension, head tension, it's very calming. It's amazing in that in um, that field. So, the next we're gonna talk about is oregano. This is definitely safe for inter internal use. This is one of my favorites. The big guns for immune support. It is not snowing down here, but I am sure that it's going to be snowing everywhere else that y'all are at. That's not funny, is it? That's not funny. It's kind of funny. No, but um, immune support, naturally. Everybody's going and getting antibiotics and this, that. Those aren't good for you either. I haven't had, had to take an antibiotic since I, I was introduced to essential oils three and a half years ago. And I was very susceptible and prone to getting tonsillitis prior to um, uh, using oils, tonsillitis, strep throat. I don't have my tonsils taken out. I would get that all the time. I was very prone to getting sick. And um, that is... That sucks, to be honest, it sucks. You don't wanna get sick because, and then people were saying, let's give me an antibiotic and it's the easy way of doing it, but you're not building your immune system back up. You're just killing off stuff in your body. You're killing off the good stuff too, the bad and the good, and you don't wanna do that. So um, oregano internally is absolutely amazing to take internally to help you um, nip anything in the bud before you're, you know, if you start to feel like you're coming down with something. Me, it starts with a scratchy throat. I take two drops of this, three, uh, one drop, if it's in the beginning, one drop, maybe twice a day for the first few days, if it starts to get you know worse, uh, which it won't, because <laughs> it just doesn't. If it, if it comes on worse than that, maybe two drops, but I can go over all of that oil protocol with you and you'll be good to go. So also, um, it's a hot oil, so you can only take it in a veggie capsule. You don't want to be putting it under your tongue like I showed you with the frankincense. Don't go to a store and say, Lindsay told me to put oils under my tongue. No, I didn't. I just basically showed you how it is that I use frankincense. So all I can do is recommend things to you. I am not a medical doctor. Let's just go over that. I am not a medical professional. 
this is what works for me and this is what I like to share with people um, because it works. It really, really does. So in any event, um, you always wanna dilute it or take it in a veggie capsule. You can dilute it in a roller bottle um, with fractionated coconut oil for the little babies. You could do one drop and just write, um, obviously they can't take them um, internally, so you can uh, up and down the spine and the bottoms of the feet to help support their immune systems too because everybody needs immune system support. And the babies, these are safe for babies. These are safe for teenagers. These are safe for toddlers. These are safe for little kids and as well as adults and the elderly. So um, it's safe for everybody. It's just how you use it, use it and the dilution um, percentage that you use in your roller bottles. So it's an excellent source of antioxidants and you can cook with this. So say you're making Sunday sauce, you wanna take a toothpick, let's see, let, let me open it. So there's a little orifice in every bottle. There's a little circle up in there. You wanna take a toothpick if, and do a toothpick swirl of oregano. That's how strong this is. That's how concentrated it is. So, um, if, I mean, if you're making a big, huge thing for, you know, a dinner of like 15, 20 people, you can use a drop. But if you're just doing it for your family, you don't wanna use a whole drop because it's gonna ruin it. It'll totally ruin it. Um, so those are the top five, what, no, those are the top six single oils in our top 10 kit. We're, I'm gonna go into four blends that are absolutely amazing, proprietary blends from um, doTERRA. The first one is On Guard, it's our protective blend. It is an internal oil. And this also supports On Guard, a protective blend. It protects you from, other, from um, environmental threats. So if you're out and about or you're traveling, you don't want to catch what everybody else has gotten or someone's sneezing, doesn't have a tissue or the airports and the, 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 the ta trade tables and the plane restrooms and all that good stuff. You don't want to touch all that stuff. Or if you're, you know, at work and you are, people are coming sick from work because they can't take off and um, you want to be able to use this proactively to, or if it's going to be snowing and you don't want to um, come down with something. This is a pro, an amazing proactive uh, way to use your essential oil internally, diffusing, um, topically, anyway, to boost your immune system and support your immune system naturally. So you can prevent any of those things, all of those things. Um, it has wild orange, clove, cinnamon, eucalyptus, and rosemary, and it smells like the holidays. But right now, what am I doing? I am doing our season um, our holiday collection that came out on November 1st it is holiday the holiday joy blend oh, so amazing that's what I have going on in my diffuser making it smell fall like up in here because I'm in South Florida and it doesn't doesn't feel like fall at all how many times have I said that already so um, it supports your immune systems pr 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 protects you against uh, environmental threats when you're out and about and it re it's really good for cleaning surfaces so you can make your own products out of these too a lot of um, kitchen products and you can get rid of all of that bleach and all of that stuff because I used to be that person if it doesn't smell like bleach it ain't clean well that is no go because ble bleach is carcinogenic I will say it is that compliant probably not am I gonna get in trouble it's okay whatever <laughs> um so it is not good for you to use that stuff that stuff is not 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 good for you let me say it again Bleach is not, not good for you. And we have done a study that uh, had a little tea tree dishes. One had bleach in it, one had three other leading competitors, and one had um, On Guard. On Guard won, people, On Guard won. And that's what I clean my whole house with. And when I wanna amp it up for like the toilet or the bathtub or tile or anything like that, put a little baking soda in it, hydrogen peroxide. Go natural, you don't need all that chemical and crap up in your house and you can't breathe and you're like, Ugh, can't breathe but I'm trying to clean my house. It's ridiculous. You're killing yourself, literally, over time. Um, so, the next blend, <laughs> that got off a little, a little bit um, too much, too much, right? I think it's the peppermint that got me all hopped up. Um, next blend is our Digest Zen blend. This is our digestive blend. And it's for digestion, so of course it's going to be safe for internal use. It has the supplemental facts label. And um, it is a blend of anise, peppermint, ginger, caraway, tarragon, coriander, and fennel. And it aids in digestion of foods. It soothes upset tummies. It maintains a healthy gastrointestinal tract. 
And it's great for traveling if you ate something that didn't jive with you or if you have motion sickness on a cruise or car sickness or anything like that. Any type of tummy troubles. Tummy troubles. You can take it in a veggie cap. It smells, it has fennel in it, so it smells like black licorice. So if you like that, a lot of people, I have a, um, on my, one of my oilers, she puts it right in her water. She's like, I love the taste. I love the smell. I'm like, okay, do you, boo. Me, not so much. Not really um, into that one. So I'll put it in a veggie cap and I'll apply it directly to my tummy. Works in um, seconds for me. Um, so uh, the next one is, or last but not least, nope, not, there, I, we got two more. Look at my notes wrong. Deep Blue is the soothing blend. This only comes in a 5 ml. You can see the difference. This is 15, this is 5. This is 15, this is five, this is our deep blue, this is our soothing blend, and it does not have the supplemental facts label on it, so you're not going to take this internally, you're going to what? Topically and aromatically. Mostly topically because this is basically like a, a massage in a bottle. So this is for any type of um, aches, pains, discomforts, anything like that. It's got laurel leaf, eucalyptus, peppermint, melaleuca, Le uh, nope, that's not it. It's got wintergreen, camphor bark, peppermint, ylang ylang, helichrysum, blue tansy, German chamomile, and osmanthus. It um, soothes sore muscles and any achy joints. Really good for any type of back or knee discomfort. You could just apply to any area topically to ease the discomfort of any type of discomfort. I like to use it with head tension or cramps or backache. That's what I usually like to use, use it for. Um, the last, last but not least is our Breathe Blend, which is our respiratory blend. It is also not for, um, safe for internal use, but it is safe for topical and aromatic use. So um, it has laurel leaf, eucalyptus, peppermint, melaleuca, lemon, cardamom, and ravensara. It supports your respiratory system, minimize the effects of seasonal threats like nature and pollen. Um, it also uh, maintains clear airways, so for noisy sleepers. Do you have a noisy sleeper? Because I do. It's very annoying. So I wear earplugs every night, and it's so bad for you because you get used to them, and then you're even more of a light sleeper than what you used to be. Um, so I, ha I left to go to Orlando for um, doTERRA post-convention tour, and I brought my earplugs with me because I could not fall asleep without them. It's Even if he wasn't there snoring, just couldn't do it. But for this, you can put it in a diffuser right next to the bed, and you can also put it on the big toe, on the bottom of the big toe, and snoring, be, oh, noisy sleepers, be gone. Caught myself there. Noisy sleepers, be gone. So that's the most popular um, oils in our top 10 starter kit. So with the top 10 comes the pedal diffuser, and I know Facebook can see it, but Instagram cannot, so. This is the petal diffuser. It goes for about four hours. I have some holiday joy up in here. Oh, it smells so good. So, um, the top ten. Mm -mm -mm. Let me just show you my handy dandy little. Hopefully, I don't drop this because I was never a server. Didn't like it. Anyway, so this is the top ten. This is called the Home Essentials Kit. So you get the top ten oils and the diffuser um, and me as your um, guidance and um, we'll be there to support you through your oil journey as well as some other fun cool support tools and education resources um, you'll also get a wel welcome bundle from me um, with the tools and the resources like roller bottles so you don't have to worry about all of the blending and stuff that I was talking about I gift to you a 10 pack of roller bottles as well as fractionated coconut oil so what is fractionated coconut oil we've all heard of regular coconut oil I'm hoping so they take it and put it in a fractionation process take out the lipids and fatty acids and stuff and the coconut smell and it always stays in a liquid form so it's an actual um, amazing um, one of our favorite us oilers it's our favorite carrier oil to use. Now you can use avocado oil, grapeseed oil, uh, olive oil, rosehip oil, jojoba oil. What else? What else is out there? What else I got over there? Almond oil, castor oil. I'm looking. I'm looking at all of them down there. Um, so you can use anything you want, but this is really, really good. It has a really good shelf life. It doesn't go rancid. It is very um, soothing to the skin. 
and it um, helps the oils penetrate better. So you can put one drop on your arm of essential oil and it'll, you know, go around. But when you use it with a fractionated coconut oil with it, it helps to um, increase the benefits and the, the reach of the essential oil for whatever it is that you're using it for. So um, basically, doTERRA will give you also an, an education book that will come with the kit that, um, that educates you about all the oils and has some starter stickers because everybody wants the little stickers that go on the bottle so you know which, which bottle is which. And um, I also have five extra special um, give the gift um, welcome bundles this month. So if you are ready to get started, please reach out to me. And if you have any questions or concerns, I'm always here for you. So again, top 10 oils and the top 10 oils and the diffuser is the Home Essentials Kit. It is called the Home Essentials Kit as it has everything that you would need to support your home and your family for uh, an 80, with 80% 80 of your health and wellness needs. And in this kit, these bottles are 15 milliliters, except for the one deep blue that I showed you. It only comes in 5 ml. But in the 15 um, milliliter bottles, it's 250 drops. And it's only one drop um, per serving, so a little will do you. And it will, um, a little goes a long way. So with 10 oils, a book, uh, and me, you can change your life from anxious feelings to sleep to digestion, immune support, respiratory support, aches, discomforts. I could go on and on and on. Um, this specific kit this month, if you get started, is um, $275. And anything over 100 PV, which is around $100 of, uh, of a starter kit or oils, you get $50 free dollars this month. That's our promo, absolutely amazing. Give the gift of health and wellness because you get 50 bucks back in free oils to use, free, product, free, free credit product, free product credits, gosh, I can't talk, free product credits back to you to use in oils. So that's also amazing too. How generous is doTERRA this month? So basically, um, this month promotions are amazing, just like I was saying. This month, Clove is um, the free product of the month if you're already with doTERRA. If you, uh, you will receive a free Clove if you, with any purchase before the 15th or before of 125 PV order, eligible order, on or before the 15th of the month. Clove is very powerful in antioxidant properties. It helps support the cardiovascular health, helps clean um, teeth and gums, and really good oral care. You can add a drop to your toothpaste. You can place a drop in an ounce of water and gargle. You can also take it in a veggie capsule to support your cardiovascular health. Um, the next promo this month is our 10% off product, like we have every single month, is Digest Zen Soft Gels. So it's basically this oil, but in already a soft gel form. I don't have them because I just put them in my veggie capsule if I need, and I already make them. So to me, it's cheaper. No offense, not trying to say, but it is. But it's a 10% off product this month, and um, it's amazing for aiding and digestion of food, soothes occasional upset stomach, helps reduce bloating, gas, occasional in in indigestion. Um, and you could take one or more for as many times as needed um, daily. And um, the gift of, the, give the gift of natural health this year. So this month when you get started, like I was saying before, um, be between the 1st and the 31st, with any 100 PV, which is about $100 in, um, in oils or you know in your order, um, you will receive 50 free credit product points in your account to go towards free oils. So this is very generous and also the holiday items have been live and some are sold out. We, they went live on November 1st. I am very sad because I didn't really get much, but these are actually from last year. This is Holiday Joy and Holiday Peace. And um, a little birdie told me that Harvest Spice, I didn't end up getting the Harvest Spice that came out and I wasn't able to get the Beautiful Blend that came out. So um, they're supposed to be going back up tomorrow uh, for a sale, for individual sale to, to see um, until they're sold out. Um, I don't know why or what's happening, but I'm very excited, not sure what time. Um, I can post for you um, on my, if you just watch my stories tomorrow, I will keep you guys updated. 
So um, our team also is um, in the European market and they still have some of the items too. So if there's something that you missed, reach out to me and I can point you in the right direction. And also if you're already on my team and you're interested in sharing or people are coming up to you and being like, hey, why you look so great? Why are you so happy? What are you doing different? And you are just organically sharing, um, let's get those oils paid for. So um, reach out to me and we can chat further about that as well. I will see you guys next Wednesday. It's going to be all about lash and brows. Woo -woo. I'll see you guys then. Have a great evening.